Hi everyone. Welcome back. This is Dr. Neha. We are starting with a new series, One PSM PYQ in One Minute. All right. So before I begin, a new batch on An Academy is starting on the 21st of July on FMG batch. You can definitely subscribe to this batch if you want. So let's see the PSM PYQ. All of the following are criteria for selection of ASHA except resident or village, women in the age group 25 to 45 years, education minimum age pass, the proposed normis to ASHA per thousand population. Now this is a very very important question. The answer to this is what? So we have to know about ASHA workers. ASHA workers, what are the criteria? on which the selection of ASHA or is based, ASHA worker has to be a resident of that village. She is a woman in age group 25 to 45 years. She can be married, divorced or separated, okay? But age group is 25 to 45 years. Now, education 8th pass, no. Now, there was a change. The minimum education which is required for an ASHA worker is she has to be at least 10th pass. The proposed norm is to ASHA, absolutely. Absolutely. But what is the existing norm? The existing norm is 1 ASHA per 1000 population. But the one that we have proposed is 2 ASHA per 1000 population. Some of the other questions that can come from ASHA worker is who selects an ASHA worker? So ASHA worker is selected by a village panchayat under the supervision of a medical officer okay all this can come as mcqs and who is responsible for training the asha worker so training is provided by anm and anganwadi worker and what is the duration of training of asha worker it is 23 days in a period of one year in any period of you know in any continuous 23 days in a period of one year she can get her training. All right. So these are some of the important questions. Remember the education qualification now is 10th pass both for hilly as well as tribal areas. Thank you so much for watching. I'll come back with another PYQ soon.